Ethiopia has made its mark in the record books by planting over 350 million trees in a single day. Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed spearheaded the project, which aims to counter the effects of deforestation and climate change in the drought-prone country. The UN says Ethiopia's forest coverage declined from 35% of total land in the early 20th century to just above 4% in the 2000s. Here's Gurum Chala with more. The name of the initiative, Green Legacy, the total number of seedlings planned for planting, 4 billion. And so far, Ethiopia has managed to plant more than 3 billion of them in less than six months' time. Within a day, a record 200 plus a million seedlings were planted across Ethiopia. Of that number, the suburbans take 3 million. So the initiative to plant for billion trees and especially 7.7 .7 million in Addis Ababa and all over today we're planning to plant 3 million. Of course the turnout will be more than 3 million and the initiative is to cope up with the current environment and so that we build a resilient economy, a resilient city so that the resident of the city will have more fresh environment. The nationwide tree planting initiative was launched by Prime Minister Abiy Ahmed himself, creating awareness about the green development and motivate reforestation were some of his plans. Hundreds of millions of people responded across Ethiopia quickly and have joined the campaign. <laughs> As you have seen, the people came out driven by their own interests to plant seedlings. In the meantime, I would like to mention to you that we are committed to protect and water these seedlings and inspire you who will see them grow well. I'm here with my child who is less than two months old. We came to leave our green legacy by planting seedlings. It simply is a god sent initiative that we are happy to be part of. I would really like it if this day could be celebrated as an yearly seedling planting day or simply a green day. I would like in this regard to thank our Prime Minister for this idea. He is our green leader. With the plan of planting 4 billion trees going well, Ethiopia is well positioned to improve its current 4% forest coverage. Addis Ababa's mayor, Takala Uma, is even hopeful the campaign could be exemplary for the rest of the African continent. Hey, climate change is real. It's not a hoax. And the initiative is to make Ethiopia green again and Addis Ababa green again. And we will always remember that Addis Ababa by itself is a fresh floor, a new flower. And we, we need to make it again. And we need to make Addis to live up to that name and remember what started in Addis is inspired all over Africa. And remember that also Addis Ababa is a seat for Africa, African Union and African people are still residing here and we are happy to have them too. Ethiopia might be grappling with all sorts of challenges from ethnic inflated chaos to political and economic instability. But with the kind of unity people are displaying across the country, experts tell you Ethiopia has a reason to hope for a brighter and stronger future soon to come. Group Dara CGTN, Addis Ababa, Ethiopia.